Hello guys, my name is Vic and for today I'm going to show you a very high potential token along with its website and its medium page. Alright, so without further ado, let's proceed to the coin or token. So the name of the token is Tab Coin. So it's currently ranked 724 in core mark market cap, right? So it has a market cap of two million two hundred thirty-five thousand nine hundred thirty-six U.S. dollars, hundred fourteen thousand five hundred eighteen U.S. dollars in the um, twenty-four hour volume. The circulating supply is four hundred fifty-four million. The total supply is one billion three hundred eighty million. Okay, so here's the chart of the Dev coin. Okay, so you can also get this um, token at these exchanges right so these are bitforex hit bdc balaxi la token and idex okay so you can also follow their twitter account okay at dev network right so this is dev coin okay so let's go to their website so you can access their website um via coin market cap or you can di directly type it at the URL bar, dav.network. So, dav means the centralized autonomous vehicle. So, it is the coin of transportation. So, a blockchain based transportation protocol enabling a decentralized peer to peer global transportation network. So, they are building a decentralized infrastructure to revolutionize the transportation industry on the blockchain. So, here you can see um, um, the overview of dav. And that there's a first Australian company to utilize the DAB protocol for shipping and logistics. And you can also follow their or like or join them rather in their social media accounts. So Telegram, Kakao Talk, Twitter, GitHub, YouTube, LinkedIn. Um, what's this one? Facebook and oh yeah, Medium. So this is their Medium. And Reddit rather, so you can follow follow them or join them at these social media pages. Okay, so DAV protocol allows anyone to utilize transportation services or put their own manned or autonomous vehicles on the network, creating a decentralized peer-to-peer -peer transportation ecosystem. So, what blockchain means to transportation today? So, the first one is decentralized ride hailing. Second one is convenient city transportation. Third one is decentralized manned deliveries. Right, so those are what means to transportation today. So block what blockchain means to transportation tomorrow. So autonomous drone deliveries, autonomous carriers, and autonomous ride sharing. So those are the three. Okay, so the DAV protocol or the DAV network, their blockchain enables rather. So this the there are four. So a verifiable ledger of historical data from service providers, manned or autonomous vehicles, and users needed for insurers and third parties. Second one is a completely decentralized system that is controlled by any government, bank, or company. Third one is a global payment standard between vehicles and their supporting infrastructure. Fourth one is a built-in smart mission contract which enables trustless cooperation between multiple vehicles and service providers. So, all right. So DAV, since DAV is a framework of open source software, open source hardware, and a free decentralized marketplace where you can buy and sell autonomous transportation services, their technology consists of three major components. So the first one is decentralized discovery, the second one is communication protocol, and the third one is trustless cooperation tools. So decentralized discovery is uh, where that the DAP allows autonomous vehicles to discover each other as well as service providers and clients around them. So this is implemented, uh, the, the DAP implements decentralized node discovery using a peer-to-peer -peer protocol that does not rely on a central server. Instead, nodes are listed in a distributed hash table which can be accessed in an extremely efficient way. Okay, so DAP the communication protocol, so it defines a library of standardized communication protocols for various transportation scenarios. 
this communication is divided into two groups. So the first one is on blockchain communication, which is done directly by calling smart contracts and through events emitted by those smart contracts. So the second one is off blockchain communication that is done um, by peer to peer using TAVS protocols. The third one is trustless cooperation tools. So trustless cooperation between buyers and sellers of transportation services is achieved using a series of specialized smart contracts. These smart contracts and even multi-party contracts between buyer, seller, and we needed between arbitrator, insurer, and others. These contracts are tied indirectly to the TAM token, guaranteeing financial resolution for transactions between multiple parties without requiring any pre-established trust. Okay, so those are the three technologies under the dev network so decentralized discovery trustless cooperation tools and communication protocol right so their protocols are okay so dev network i've already made a lot of protocols so let's check um, them one by one right so they call it the community built modules so the first one is drone charging network so the current status for this is this is made possible by one of their alliance member where the it is currently offered in northern Italy where the, there are already five charging stations so these stations offer charging services through the DAV network in exchange for DAV tokens we should drone flight planning so then this is the second one okay so it is also done by or made possible by one of their alliance member and it is currently offered in Nevada USA so as you can see uh, the drone will follow waypoints of their planned trip and then this is um, very beneficial for you because you'll know when and where your drone is okay and you'll know what time will the drone arrive so you, this is like monitoring your drone right so this is very very nice okay so the next one is drone admissions app so this is the first mission first app built to showcase the DAP ecosystem so the current status for this is that they have cur they're currently into um, there's an integration with the first drone partner, Captor Express, is underway, right? So this is Captor Express drone. So this is an app example. So in here, um, users request drone services. Drones bid for those services, and trustless cooperation is enabled by using the blockchain. So the third, uh, the next one is the DAV CLI and testnet. So their command line interface. So it was built to make developing application services that interact with them a much more pleasant experience. Okay. So the current status is that fully functioning testnet and identity generation already used by its foundation projects work in connecting the registration functionality where the identity smart contract is in progress. Okay. So the next one is a dev developer portal. So it's the developer. Uh, uh, the developer portal incorporates API documentations, communication protocols, and instructions for running in com their command line interface, local testnet, and block explorer. So multiple communication protocols is written. And a user guide for their CLI tools is now available. Okay, so the block explorer. So the current status for this is work is underway to package the block explorer, enabling it to launch automatically from the dev CLI tools. Mission control. So this is the next one. So the current status is fully working for running simulated environments with drone deliveries it's currently being expanded to support the vehicles of their first partners. So the next one is one of my favorite. So this is the autonomous mode. So this is the autonomous mode. So Dav and the California Maritime University are developing an autonomous mode called Nemo. So when launched at the end of September, Nemo will be tasked with collecting ocean and graphic measurements in the San Francisco Bay. When Nemo runs low in energy, it connects to the DAV network purchase and pay for charging stations, or rather services rather, with DAV tokens and after it charges head back to sea. Nemo will demonstrate true autonomy by spending money to take care of its own needs, allowing it to operate independently for long periods at sea. So this is Nemo, right? So this is very, very nice as you can see, right? So the current status for this is boat is ready. Work on the onboard computer is in, and its final integration with the DAV network is in progress. Okay, so the next one is search and rescue robot. So this is also one of my favorite. So this robot will locate um, lost drones or um, drones that have lost contact with their owners. So what he's going to do is go to their 
what it's going to do is go to their last known location and then using its onboard lighter, computer vision, find them and send back their exact coordinates. So the current status for this is Rossbot's computer vision algorithms are being updated to support identifying drones. So as you can see, their protocols are very, very nice. And as a drone lover my, myself, this is very, very um, interesting, right? So I'm hoping that someday the these uh, will these protocols will expand, right? So as you can see, these are their protocols, right? So let's go back to their main website. So this is the roadmap, and you can also download their white paper here at their website. And uh, this are the list of their um, advisors so these are from renowned companies okay and also their main team so this consists of their founder and their co-founders and of course their developers and the other, their other staffs right so since DAB is an open source software so there's a lot of open source contributors also so as you can see can also become one here by sending details to DAO. So they also have their own DAO alliance. So this is the uh, most interesting part here. Okay, so they've, they've got a lot of lights members. So let's go to the alliance page. So the benefits of becoming an alliance member is shared knowledge and influence members of the DAO alliance benefit from shared knowledge and experience amongst members but also gain value from an interest group that could have a greater ability to influence policy and mindset regarding autonomous vehicles across jurisdictions so the second one is blockchain technology and then they have protocol access to latest technology innovations trends and learnings within the blockchain industry from leading technologists experts and strategists access to blockchain applications and the DAB protocol specific to the future of transportation okay so they are building a decentralized commons for all so DAB alliance members will be at the forefront of decentralized transportation and autonomous vehicle adoption by the mainstream so it is their goal to help bring this remarkable technology to the world and to share the benefits and successes with their members right so you can also become part of their alliance member by filling out the form here Okay, so this is the alliance page, right? And if you want to join their telegram, you can also click here. And if you want to view their YouTube channel, you can follow them clicking this link here, right? So some facts about DAP also are also here. Okay, so this is the website of DAP token. So it's full of information right so this is their medium page also so um, because I'm fond uh, or I'm fond of reading um, articles I find this medium page very interesting also right so if I were you I'll include dab coin on your research and I know you'll love this one see their technology and see their um mission okay so dav coin the coin of transportation right so before i go i just want to say that i am not a financial advisor and everything i say here is not a recommendation for you to buy and sell using crypto right or to buy or sell crypto rather okay so you must always do your own research before deciding for yourself so this is Vic once again, signing off. Bye-bye.